Okay, so this is actually the warm up. Uh, to start with these exercises, what we're, gonna, what we're gonna do is we're gonna be marching and moving my arms in circles. I'm gonna move three times to the front and then I'm gonna go three times to the back. Okay, so again, three times to the front and three times to the back. So this is the warm up. The warm up, uh, I always suggest two minutes. If you wanna do a little more, it's better, a little less, it's okay. If you get tired when you do this, just bring your elbows down and just go like that. Three times to the front, three times to the back. If lifting your knees becomes too hard within those two minutes, you can just go a little slow, a, a little lower, three times to the front, three times to the back. So you can always create the level that will suit you better. A stretch and range of motion, number one. Uh, this is very basic, very simple. The first exercise is called split sun salutations. Okay, so for the split sun salutations, I want one leg in the front, one leg in the back, both my arms up. I'm gonna bring my shoulders back and my arms all the way back to stretch my, my uh, upper body. So I go all the way up, inhale, and then exhale. I go down here. If right here bothers my back a little bit, I'm gonna frame on my knee and my close to my ankle. I'm gonna frame here just to take a little bit the pressure on my lower back. And I want to stay five to 10 seconds. On every exercise we do, we want to stay five to 10 seconds. All right, then we switch to the other leg. I'm going to do it in this direction now. Both arms up, shoulders back, and then, and I go all the way down. I'm going to stretch. Again, I can try to go all the way down here, or I can frame just to take the pressure from my lower back. And then I roll slowly back up. To finish with this one, we're going to do the front, side, and back kicks. So basically what I do, this is range of motion. I'm going to try to kick straight, kick side, kick back. Then switch to the other leg, kick straight, kick side, kick back. If this is hard for me on my balance, I can grab a chair. And right here, I'm gonna use that chair to create just more balance. When I do the exercise, I go one, two, three, and then I switch to the other side, work on the other leg. One, two, three. That is the first exercise of this. Okay, so this exercise is the um, straight airplane sun salutation. It's kind of like the one we did before with the splits, but in this case, we're gonna be straight, separate the feet a little bit, same idea, I bring my arms back, go as high as I can, and then I'm gonna go down like an airplane right here and try to touch my toes again if this puts a little pressure on my lower back I can grab close to my ankles to frame you see my elbows my elbows can go on my knees and that's gonna help me frame okay. you cannot go that low you can just go a little higher close to your knees and frame that's so you're still getting the benefits of the stretch but you're not putting the pressure on your lower back until your lower back gets stronger. So one more time, we go up here, inhale, exhale, and right there. I can touch the floor, my toes, I can frame here if I need it, or maybe frame a little higher. But we will feel that stretch on the back of our legs. Okay. To continue with this one, we have the, uh, the side to side squats. So this is more range of motion for your hips. So what we're gonna do is, we're just gonna go from one side to the other. That's it, one side to the other, okay? One side to the other for about a minute. And uh, if, if it becomes a little hard or it, it's hurting, you can shake
going to put a little more pressure on my back, but I, you see my hands, I can grab my knee and frame it like that. It's easy to frame here, but you can also frame down there. It's just a little more advanced. Or you can just slide your hand once you have enough strength on your upper body. So after that, we go to the other side. We're just going to start with hands on the waist, right there. And again, about 5 to 10 seconds to start. You can go all the way up to 20 seconds on each one. These are isometric stretches. You stay on the position. Always breathe normal during the position. Uh, do a deep breath before you start. For example, here I go like, take my deep breath and exhale. I don't have to hold my breath here, just breathe normal. I go back to the center. Inhale, exhale. And during the 10 seconds, I just stay here and just breathe more. Uh, the next one will be for this same exercise, the continuation for the range of motion. I'm going on my lunge position. And I'm, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to the front and back. So I go one and two. When I go back, I'm going to bend my knee a little bit. So I go one and two. One and two. Make sure you're always straight, okay? So after three of these, we're gonna switch to the other side and do three more, just like that, front and back. Notice how I bend in my back knee right there when I go back, just a little bit. That's gonna create that range of motion and strength on your legs. This next one, we're gonna do the torso twist. So the torso twist, simple exercise. I wanna be straight right here, always straight. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna move my head. I'm gonna to try to look as far back as I can so my head follows and my body follows. And I'm twisting all the way. I'm gonna stay here for about 10, uh, five to 10 seconds. Just breathing normal, and then I switch to the other side, five to 10 seconds. This is the basic torso twist. Just <coughs> motion, motion, one side, five to 10 seconds, then the other side, five to 10 seconds. All right, and to continue, uh, we're gonna do the hula hoop circles. So this, basically what I'm doing is just moving my waist three times into one direction and then three times on the other direction. Three times in one direction, three times on the other direction for about a minute. All right, All right. and to do, do the last one, this last exercise, I call it the chair twist. So basically what I'm doing here, I'm going to grab a chair. I'm going to cross one leg and the idea is to pull my knee towards my left in this case and my body towards the right. Five to ten seconds. So I'm going to breathe, inhale, exhale and stretch. You should feel this stretch on your IT band going all the way down to your hip. You're gonna go right here, five to 10 seconds. And then we switch to the other side and we do the same thing and move onto that side, five to 10 seconds. Okay, and we're gonna be doing this for a minute. Right, on one direction, five to 10 seconds. And then on the other, five to 10 seconds. Once we finish this, we do to the range of, uh, of motion part. So that's gonna be knee circles. So I'm gonna put my hands on my, on my kneecaps and I'm gonna move my knees in a full circle three times into one direction and then three times in the other direction. So I go three times 
towards the left <coughs> and then three times towards the right everything we do uh, it's gonna be about a minute we can as you start you're gonna do a minute as we progress uh, you can do a minute and a half or two minutes on each one okay